This is Hannah. As you can see, she's walking around just fine right now. That's because she's been on almost her 30-day course of doxycycline. She is a almost 10-year-old German Shepherd, and she was going very lame on us, really having difficulty with her shoulders, her back legs, and not getting well, around well at all. And as you can see, on doxycycline, she walks around almost just fine. And she's still sore when she gets up. She does have some arthritis. But for the most part, doxycycline almost makes her normal again. I'm going to show a video when she's not on doxycycline and having her walk around in the yard and doing all these things. And you'll see her really struggling. So, and she won't be over here digging her holes. <laughs> she probably got... Um, auriculosis when we lived in Missouri. We had 300 acres behind our house and we used to hike quite a lot. And uh, even though she was always on flea and tick medicine, she would get bit by ticks. I would get bit by ticks too. And it takes a while for them to die. So they have to bite them to die. And sometimes they don't die right away. This is her doing great. And we love it when she's on doxycycline. She unfortunately has auriculosis so bad that she will never be cured. She has to take doxycycline every few months. And we have a month of her walking around normal and acting like a normal dog. And in between, unfortunately, she gets very, very painful joints. And I'll take a video of that and show you um, in about a month, if not sooner. And then, of course, we have to wait a little bit because we can't keep her on medicine all the time. And then uh, she will start looking really bad. So if you have a dog that's been diagnosed with auriculosis, this is pretty much what your life is probably going to be like with it. You'll have these little spurts of times where right now she's on medicine and she's doing great. And we take advantage of this. We take her for lots of walks. We take her swimming. We're really, really active during these times because we want to make the most of them. But um, unfortunately, we can't keep her like this all the time which is really hard because she's in pain otherwise and her joints swell up and you could tell she's just not happy. Whereas right now she's got her little happy alert face on and uh, these are the great times to be, uh, you know, when she's on medicine to be out and doing things. So I'll show you another video soon of her not doing so well and you will know what to expect with your dog who gets that unfortunate disease as well.